I'm used to drinking hand sanitizer. I can't do this. So the first couple we're going to be talking about is Destiny and Sean. Basically, this is the dude who was 45 years old but told Destiny that he was 36 or something while she was in prison. In any case, they come out. Um, where her prison is is not where Sean lives because he lives in Las Vegas so they're gonna move out there they go on the plane wait she's excited as you would be just got out of prison a few days hey gonna go to Las Vegas of all places so they go to his house his house is huge it's beautiful it looks like one of those influencer houses white walls spacious it looks amazing he's very cute in the sense that he's got her makeup all laid out I saw a charcoal mask I don't even know how he knows half this stuff but anyway he's been married before and he has six kids yes six so he probably knows about all this stuff and he's really bought her clothes and everything so she's looking around she's like this is so nice this that that she sits on the bed she's like this is super comfy she's looking at all the dresses and she's like I'm going out tonight I'm going out tonight um, nothing is gonna stop Destiny from going out, okay? Nothing. So he has two friends, like a couple that are going to visit them and he wants Destiny to meet this couple. And he wants them to have a dinner and he's gonna cook for them, whatever. And she's like, look. Hector and his wife better be fun because I'm going out tonight. The problem with all this is, obviously, you know, she's been in prison and all that. And the danger is, not necessarily saying that this will happen with all uh, felons or whatever, but the danger obviously is that she is really looking forward to living that life, right? She's ready to explore, she doesn't care about anything. She wants to get out there. I wanna go out, I wanna do something. But he's like, you can have a quiet night in, and why is he so, you know, holding, you know, really being like cautious, is because in two weeks time, she has a court date, and she has to make it to this court date where they're gonna discuss God knows what. But if she doesn't go there, he's made it that he will be responsible for $50,000 if they do not make it to this court date so she has to behave make sure she doesn't get incarcerated again make sure she doesn't get caught like drinking acting all crazy right but she's determined and also this destiny she's swearing every two seconds i don't know if you know when they're doing this prison talk it's all cutie cutie and it's all like i love you and you're my best friend and i can't wait to hold you in my arms and then when they get out they're either super ratchet they're swearing every five seconds they don't look like the pictures that were sent or that they saw on inmate.com or whatever ridiculous site they find these people at. I met Destiny on a prison pen pal site. Yeah, basically these people turn out to be something that, something different, completely different. But he's happy he's got himself a young chick because he's like, what, 28? Something like that. So, hmm, interesting. You send her money? Yeah, oh. thousands. This is so funny, y'all. Destiny comes out and she's like, babes, to Sean or babe, whatever. Is this dressing like good to rock it in Las Vegas? And he's like, you look good. Okay. Then the co-worker of Sean, and I remember he works in like a car shop. So he's like maybe a mechanic, something like that. Anyway, his house is amazing. Whatever he's doing, we should probably all be doing because his house is amazing. Please like the video. Co-worker Hector and his wife, they come over. And they start talking. The co-worker is actually very free-spirited. His wife is a little bit, bit more calm. I feel like the one should be dating the other, actually. It's kind of like they're both dating like opposite, very opposite people, but you know, opposites attract. So anyway, the co-worker is here, Hector, and he's like, 24 hours a day, the bars don't close. Oh my God, I never even knew that. Sean's like, well, thanks. And he's like, you know what? I, I don't want to be here. I don't want to eat any of this stuff. I want to go out. I want to go out and party. Let's go right now. So they don't have any food and they go. I wanted to go out. Like, it's my first day in Vegas. I've never been to Vegas. Like, I want to go party, dude. And Hector is like, I'm ready to twerk. And Desi's like, ha, ha, ha. That's exactly what I was thinking. And Sean's like, oh, my God. What did I get myself in? To get to this bar and Desi's like, what's the strongest drink that you guys have? And the bartender's like, do you want it strong or strong, strong? And she's like, hella strong. And so they get her a drink. And she's like, she's ready to get messed up. It's all about getting messed up. I don't, I, I really don't. I've been out plenty of times. For me, if there's no dancing involved. Have you subscribed? Okay. It's boring. Just getting messed up for what? To j just destroy your liver, say things you regret, act silly and blame it on the a a a a a alcohol. Comment, I want to know what you think. Oh, you must be joking. Like, mm-mm. And then Sean is all like, I'm gonna put you outside, you know, if you get messed up and stuff like that. But 
she does not care and Hector's wife seems super unbothered at some point she's just like this woman is too wild for me then all of a sudden Destiny is saying that there are pretty girls in prison and they're questioning her like oh okay did you did you date any did you do anything with any of them she's like no but in the confessional she's all like yeah you know I did and I, I was messing with a bunch of them. Then they asked her about whether she has a list of things that she wants to do. She's like, she wants to have a bank account, joint bank account, you know, get married, this and that. I'm like, blah, 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 it's good. Joint bank account? Sean, please don't do that. Don't put your money where her money is so that your money can get a eh, bit mixed up with her money. Like that is such a bad idea. In any case, that's what she says. And um, yeah, she's just over here. She's, she's really acting crazy. She's acting crazy and at the end of it, she's messed up. Hector's wife has been drinking water at, at Sean's crib. Non-alcoholic beverage at this uh, club pub thing. You guys want a beer or something? Yes. Water? Water? Please. Also, did these people really not eat? Because if they really did not eat, this is very, very, very sad. This is very, very sad. Imagine being invited to somebody's house to go and eat. You get there and the woman of the house is like, screw this, we're going out, we're going to drink, I want to get messed up what uh -uh. i would stay in that house look in the fridge see what's around like i didn't eat all day to come here to eat you know when you're invited to eat somewhere you might eat a little light things here and here but depending on where you're going sometimes you'll starve yourself because you know the food about to be amazing these people come to this man's house and you're gonna now dictate what happens you're not interested in getting to know these people you're not interested in asking questions about sean you're just interested in going out and partying like oh, it's just dreadful